So now I've got a couple more of these shed locks or gate locks. I've picked these open in the past. I did a video not too long back showing you how to open one with a couple of nails. But today we're going to open this with just a coat hanger. Now these are simple to open because there's only one lever inside. So I'm going to pick this open with a coat hanger. Then I'm going to show you how it works on this other one. If you've not seen the previous video, I did picking these open with a couple of nails. So it all works okay. And if you looked at the key, you might think there was a lot going on inside that lock. But as you can see, there's nothing inside the lock. It's dead simple. So first of all, let's show you how to pick it with a coat hanger. So I've got a normal coat hanger and I've put a little bend on the top. This one's coated in white plastic or something. It's all coming off, but normally these are just uh, plain wire. So yeah, we'll use that. So what you do is you put your wire in and you push it down. Now when you're pushing it down, you need to turn it at the same time and it'll open up as you can see, it's open. So once you've got that part done, it's easier just to put your wire back in and push it down like that to fully throw the bolt. It's a little bit harder to try to twist it. It's easier to throw the bolt by pushing it down. So that's how simple these are to open. So this is one with a cover off and I'll just show you how it works. That's already open. So what we'll do is we'll lock this one up first and then I'll show you how it all works. So now that's in the lock position. So what's happening is when you're putting your wire in, you're pushing down on that bottom lever. And I'll do it in my hand because it's a lot easier to push it down. So when you're pushing that bottom lever down, it's obviously moving the top lever as well. And if you can see the top lever going up, it goes in line with the gate so the bolt can go through the gate. So once you've pushed the lever down with your wire, obviously it's in line with the gate and then you twist it. And as you twist it, you'll see it pushes the bolt across. But when you get to that stage, the wire moves completely around. So that's why it's better to put your wire back in after and then just push it like that to fully open the bolt. So yeah, that's a simple shed or gate lock with one lever in picked open using a coat hanger. And that's it for today. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Try a bit.